A terrible fucking kid. Amber and N Fierno. E-N-F-I-E-R-O. Because she's sticking a bottle in her fucking pussy and shoot her across the wall. <laughs> okay, so what do you want me to do? Growing up like I did. Where are you right now? Oh, don't worry where I am. I'm by myself. What are you, what is it? Yeah, no, last thing I thought you were at a fucking restaurant or something. Are you no, I, yes, Lauren, what is it? Growing up like I did. Okay. I grew up, okay. I grew up with mom. I remember things about being at, at home with mom and, and the rest of us kids in Cornville. And I remember Dale coming every now and then with his pop shot. And then I remember us moving to Cambridge. Okay. And I remember us being there. But it seemed like when I when we moved to Cambridge, Lori moved out with her new boyfriend, which turned in to be her husband. Then Ralph moved uh, moved in with Lori with his girlfriend, which her name was Lori. Okay. And and so I, that's where I lost my two protectors. And then Roy was actually my last protector. But he moves to California. A lot of fucked up things happen to kids by adults. By adults, not other kids, like what you're talking about. By adults. And I was just saying this the other day. I cannot imagine some of the things that kids have to deal with in America and, and across the world. But I'm in America. I'm going to speak about Americans. I can't even imagine. I had two knee injuries. I can genuinely see if this was a, if, if if this was a child, there are some ch- children whose parents wouldn't even take them to get care to get checked out. Oh, you can walk. Oh, you'll be fine. Oh, you can run. Stop pretending like you don't want to. Stop being lazy when the child has a torn ACL and and torn meniscus. Okay, there are really bad things that happen to children, but none of it justifies growing into an adult and trying to rape children. Having a having bad things no, happen. That's, that's as I was saying, you, as I, I was saying why I did that. As I was saying, having a bad childhood or bad things happen to you in your childhood is not a ticket into little girls' panties. It is not. And I, I want you to know you never believe me too because I been so serious about anything in my fucking life. I never wanted to fucking do that. I never wanted to do the things I did. I never wanted to say the things that I did. But how does it make I it any less bad what it. you did that you that you say that you didn't want to? Huh? How does how does it make it any less bad that you didn't want to? You say that you didn't want to. How does it make it any less bad? Hello? Okay, you're cutting out. Can you come back to the phone? Hey, hang on a minute. I'm going to pee in this bathroom I've never peed in before. Okay, come back when you're finished peeing. I don't like his bathroom. No. All right, can you hear me? I can hear you. I did not say that, uh, that what I did makes it any less bad. Okay. So then why do you keep saying that you didn't want to do it, and why do you keep emphasizing that? Because I'm, because you're my girlfriend, and it means a lot to me that you know that I did not want to do it. And, it, and it's, it's like you're not going to understand until you see me in person, evidently. 
that I did not want to do it. Well, it's not, uh, I, until you ever spend time with me in person, you're going to realize the, the actual person that I am. I did not want to fucking do it. Lauren, you, you have to understand something, okay? You're um, basing it all off me and you not being in person, too. No, I'm and not. You keep that in mind. No, keep it in Lauren, mind. Lauren, doesn't matter who I'm in person with. It, it, it doesn't matter. It matters to me. It, I'm, I'm telling you, if you and I were face-to-face... Because let me tell you something. It'd be different. You keep saying that you didn't want to do it, right? If, if I had not been saying it for this long, do you think that I would not mean what I'm saying? Lauren, that... Do you think I would eventually fucking give in? Okay, I meant to do it. No, no, no. I haven't given in to, to it yet. Okay, listen. And I'm not going to. Okay. You saying that you did not want to do it, you keep saying that. Okay? <laughs> You've said that many times, not just tonight, but many times. You keep saying that you didn't want to do it. You saying that is terrifying because do I have to be afraid of you doing something to me that you that you say that you didn't want to do when you no. say, okay, but see, you're here. You are. You're saying that you didn't want to do something. You've expressed that you did. That there's something that you did that you didn't want to do. Yeah, you're not gonna do that to me. I'm not gonna do you're what? Not, you're not gonna put those words in my mouth with words like that. What words am I putting no. in your mouth? Because it, because what you're saying is, do I have to be terrified? That you're going to rape me some night or beat me some night and me say that I did not mean to do it or that I did not want to do it? No. I didn't say the word rape or beat, but I mean... Yeah, well, uh, no, you didn't, but I, uh, but I know what you're saying, and I'm fucking putting it out there. No, I'm not that type of person. I'm not the type of person to beat somebody. I'm not the type of person to rape somebody. The fact of the matter is, is I didn't want to do it, and I knew I didn't want to do it. The reason I did it is because I couldn't fucking think straight because I was so fucked up because I was thinking way too fucking highly about people that I weren't, I shouldn't be fucking thinking highly about. I was vulnerable and naive at the same fucking time. Okay, so, but still, you're saying that you didn't want to do, you clearly did something that you're now going back and saying that you didn't want to do. And Why are you that doing is, that? Why are you what? doing that? Why am I doing what? Why are you trying to paint me into something that I'm not? What am I trying to paint you into? You're telling me that I did something that I didn't want to do, but I did it anyway. But that's what you said. You said that you didn't want to do any of this. I said it, but I said it, but you're not saying it in the way that I said it. You're saying it in the way that fucking makes me look bad. Wait, what? Why are you doing that? How? Okay, you said something, and then I repeated it, and now you're saying that it looked bad. What? Yeah, but what I'm saying is not hard to understand. Okay, you're saying what you're, that, what you're saying is is making me look bad. Okay, you're saying that you're saying the night that you committed a felony, you did not want to do it. I'm asking you. Hey, yeah, uh, I'll give you your fucking words. Okay, I'm a bad person. I'm a bad person. I wanted to fucking rape a fucking thirteen year old so that I can get my own fucking jollies, just because. Just because my family treated me fucking badly. There. There are your words. That's the words that you wanted me to fucking say. I said the words that you want to say. Well, now I'm not going to say the words that I actually mean. I didn't want to fucking go there. Now stop fucking putting this shit on me. Okay, so I ask you again, are there other situations in which you would do stuff that you didn't want to do? Like what? Well, I don't know. What are you asking me? 
leaving me. Lauren, you are saying that there that you do things that you didn't want to do. That's your whole driving force when you talk about this. I'm I was asking. In, I, was, I was influenced by my fucking brothers, my oldest brother, and my oldest sister. Because I was naive and I thought they were the fucking top of the world. That's why they got as much good treatment out of me as they did with my fucking money. Where did they get my macaroni cheese from? Well, a year later. But she needed another 500 fucking hours. What, how hard is that to understand? How hard is what to understand? I loved, I loved them. They didn't fucking love me. How hard is that to understand? Put it in other words. When are you going to get off this shit with me, Ramona? You're doing it time and time again. What am I doing time and time again? Well, if you want me to repeat everything I said already. I have not asked you to repeat anything. Then we're getting away from the past. What? We're getting away from the past. I'm not going to talk about the past anymore, including fucking Emma. Okay, I didn't I say don't want, I don't want the mistake that I fucking did brought up anymore. Okay, I did not even say anything about Emma. But if yeah, you're... but I'm saying it. But... I, I'm, tired of that. I'm tired of living in the past. Then why do you use the past for as an excuse for things that you do? In because the you keep bringing it up. No, you use. Yes, the... you don't. With what I fucking did, and then then we see. You don't. You bring it up. Lord, I want I... it gone. Hey. I want it. It's, it's been ten years. I want it out of my life. Hey, Lauren, you use the past constantly as a justification for the things that you do. I want it out of my fucking life. I'm tired of it. I'm telling you, I'm so fucking tired of it. I don't want to talk about the past anymore. Then why do you use it as an excuse for things that you do? Anything you do. you use it as an excuse to bring shit up about me doing shit wrong. Okay, Lauren. Why can't you just live with the person that I am now? Okay, Lauren. Whenever you message me or whenever you do anything... And I say, Lauren, why did you do such and such a thing? Well, the past. In the past, I've been hurt. You, you. Uh-huh. Okay, so, so well, you're. I'm trying to, I, I've got myself to the place where I fucking believe in you. I've told this fucking prison thing was the first time I have ever had the fucking balls to ask you, do you have anything to do with fucking him and this fucking piece of shit in Canada? That's the first time I've ever had the fucking balls to ask you about that. Okay, so you asked me about that. I don't understand what that has to do with any of what we've been discussing. I want us to be us. But, I, want but, you to get a, I want you to get a burn phone. You want me to get what? A burn phone. See, I, like, again, I go back to... Me too. Like the phone that I had. It's no different than what you fucking said before. And maybe you should get a second phone. I'm agreeing. Yeah, you should get a second phone. A I've phone. I've never a said phone. I should get it. I've never yeah, said yes, I should get it. Yes, no, you I did. did not. Lauren, yes, I you did, did not. Lauren, you I did, did not. Yes, I you never did. said that. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. Okay, you said I never said day. that. You said it the other day. Maybe you, you said it the other day. Maybe a new phone, a second phone, not a second phone. I said, what would you, kill you? What would kill you to get a thirteen dollar phone? It's so not you have, so you could have on me, so that you and I could talk, and nobody would fucking be up to fucking hack into it. It's not what even. Would a, kill you, what would kill you to do that? Okay, it's not even the point of getting the phone and spending thirteen dollars on a phone. The point is that. Because of things that you've done, I now have to go out and spend additional money and carry around a second phone and keep track of the phone. I have $13. Yeah, it's not going to be... I got to spend a fucking thousand dollars to, to get your ass up here. You want to fucking bitch about a $13 phone. First of all... Uh, that ain't fucking going to work. It's not like you have to pay for dates. It's not like you have to pay for anything that guys who are in person have to pay for. All you have to do is talk on the phone. 
So, I mean, you're complaining about buying a plane ticket. And you're complaining about buying a $13 phone. Because I should not have to. And since when am I bitching? What is that supposed Why to be? Why would you not want to? I should not to, have to. To make sure that you and my conversations were fucking safe and nobody was fucking listening. Why would you not want to spend $13 on a fucking burn phone? First of all, I didn't say I wouldn't, but I'm saying I should not have to. It is not fair for me to have to. I'm not going to go around and around about this shit. It's not, it's not that hard of a fucking thing. Is not that hard of a thing. For you, Lauren. Oh, it's hard for you? It's hard for you to buy a 13 dollar phone? No, 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 no. No, Lauren, again, it's not about the money. It is about the principle. It is about the fact that I have to go I'm to not the- going to the principle, Ramona. I'm done fucking around with this bullshit of the internet in Emma. And this piece of shit in Canada. What I'm not that? fucking with it anymore. I'm going to change my fucking number. You're the only one that's going to have it. You need to get a burn phone so that you and I can talk through that. I'm not going to have any fucking hacking bullshit. Nothing. It's going to be me and you. I'm not fucking going through any horse shit anymore. Lauren, you caused the horse shit, not me. It wasn't my fucking phone that got hacked. Your brother knew Emma. That's how he got fucking hacked. Lauren. Don't put it all on me. It it's is through not, the thing, though. It is not about my brother knowing Emma. He knew her. Um, he, 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 she, he was in contact with her long before any of this stuff started hacking or started happening. I, I don't give a fuck. I am never going to talk to that bitch again. Ever. Okay, okay nobody Ever. said it. Okay, again, nobody said anything about you talking to her. But the fact of the matter is you and only you contributed it to some of the garbage that they have done. Why are you fighting me so hard about getting a goddamn burn phone? So Lord, that you and I can have fucking contact with only each other. Lauren, it, it, it's because I should not have to. It, what the hell does it matter? Lauren, you don't see how you're it's asking. It's not something that I did. I did not give anybody your number. No, but you flirted. You're not going to blame it on me. No, but you flirted with everyone. You're fucking blaming it on me. I did not give anybody your... What? Regardless of what I flirted on me with before, your number was not involved. What? Your number was not involved when I flirted with whoever I flirted with. Yeah, but I they... I thought you for number one. My... So don't, don't, don't even fucking bring who I flirted with before about your number. Okay. They, you might not have given them my number, but you gave them a reason not to like me. You gave them a reason... Oh, bullshit. The fucking guy came to love you. Okay, so then I why... I don't what he said. He, he likes you. Didn't yeah, want you. Didn't want to hurt you. Yeah, he Why was, are you fighting getting your burn phone? Yeah, he was encouraging me to get away from you. Why do you think he would do that? But, uh, I, I don't give a fuck why he wanted to do it. It's a matter of you get a burn phone, he has no fucking knowledge. Why are you fighting me on this, Ramona? I am not fighting you on it. I am you're just... fighting me because you're not telling me I say you're going to get a burn phone so just you and I can talk on that burn phone. 
I am not fighting you on it. I am. Yeah, you are. Okay, as I was saying, I am saying that it is disturbing that I even have to go to that step because you don't know how to not flirt with people online. I know. Uh, I'm not flirting with anybody online now. So that, oh, yeah. that excuse is, uh, uh, I did. Uh, I did you wrong in the past. Yes, I did. I'm not doing it now, and I, I'm never going to do it again. So okay. you can believe me or not. That's up to you. Okay, so when are you going to get your computer back? I fact, if I know, and I don't care. I don't even care to go on the fucking. I'm happier without that fucking thing. I am so much fucking happier without that thing because I'm I'm actually living. Okay, one minute you're saying look at that your life is shit, and then the next minute you're telling me that you're living. It is, it? It is shit right now. My fucking uncle's dying again. Another uncle acts like an asshole. I'm not sure where the fucking live. Waiting, waiting to find out about this fucking property next door. Why would my life not be fucking shit? Okay, but now you said you're happy because you're listening. The good about my life is fucking you and mom. Okay. So you fucking tell me, why should my life not be shit right now? It's not like you don't know what's going on in my life because I fill you in on everything. I like what you do for me. And you don't fill me in on everything. What don't like I fill you? Like a doctor, like a doctor spending so much time with you and your brother. Like okay. you never explained to me the other night. Okay, so you're you're jealous because I have a friend in the doctor. Oh, I wasn't jealous before until you said not telling me about it. First of all, you stopped asking about him. And second of all, I mean, every time I... Why well, should I have to ask? As I was you saying, know, you don't have to the shit in my life, and I tell you anyway. Okay, as I was saying, no matter what I do, you always accuse me of doing something with the doctor. So and I mean, no matter what I do, it's always not perfect. Okay, like I said, there is a very, very large gap between things that you do and perfect. Okay. Yep. There's a whole bunch well, of stuff in between. I'm trying to be perfect for you. You're failing miserably. Well, uh, gee, that's that, that's nice to know considering you have the doctor over there every night. First of all, I don't have the doctor over here every night. You make it sound like I live with the doctor. From what you told me before, he's the fucking there quite often. Well, this is my apartment, and I pay the rent, so I can have whoever I want over. Well, evidently you want the doctor over pretty often. And if I do, I mean, who? what does it matter who I want over? Well, when you have a boyfriend, it should fucking matter a little bit. Yeah, and look how you treat me. And look how you treat me. Which is, okay, which is how? How often have I caught up your calls? Lauren, I am not sitting around. No, 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 no. That, that's not the question. The question is, uh, is, how often have I cut off your calls? You have never cut off my calls. But here's even, the... when, even when I'm with my mother. Yeah, you've never I've cut off. never cut your calls off. You've never cut my calls off. But here's the difference. I have a life outside of you. And I don't have a life outside of you? Absolutely not. I don't, really. All you, all you do is is message me and chase after me. No, Lauren, you don't. You have shown zero really? signs. Yes, Lauren, you've shown zero signs of having a life outside of me. Maybe right. sex offender class. Okay, let me tell you this. This is, this is not what you mean to me. Okay, I, I hear it. I hesitate in running a skill saw just in the fact that I might miss hearing your, uh, a text message coming from you. Okay, and what did I tell you about that? Don't tell me, don't tell me even for a minute that you don't fucking mean shitload to me. Hey, Lauren. You, you're on the top of my fucking list with mom. 
Okay, Lauren, what did I tell you about that? I told you. I know. You... But don't, don't fucking ever put the fucking doctor above me. Don't put your friends above me if we're going to be, if we're boyfriend and girlfriend. Lauren, yeah, I... Did you, did you send me a message once that said that, that I wasn't first, I wasn't second, and I wasn't third? You put your fucking uh, friends uh, above your boyfriend, there's issues there. Lauren, I have never met you. I don't give a fuck if you met me or not. You've known me for fucking almost a year. We spent so much fucking time together, and Lauren, it's unbelievable. Okay, Lauren. There's no reason that you should be putting people before me. That you shouldn't be putting me for me when I'm being considered your boyfriend. Lauren. It's no different over the phone than we are we will, than we would be in person. Lauren. You have no right to dictate who I put where and what I do. Are you kidding? You have no right to fucking hold back my life. If you're not gonna put me, your boyfriend, before your fucking friend. Because I'm not holding you back from having friends. Lauren, you told me before that you wanted to approve of all my friends if I were living with you. Bullshit. You did. Bullshit. Lauren, you did. Yeah, like fucking hell I did. Lauren, you did. I know goddamn well I didn't say that. Lauren, you did say that because you said you don't trust anybody else and you would want to approve all of my friends first. Oh, bullshit. I said I don't trust anybody else. With uh, with you regarding you, I don't trust anybody else with my information. Lauren, you said I that. I don't Don't you fucking dare turn this shit around. Don't you don't. Okay, don't tell I'm me not... fucking. Uh, I said things that I did not say because that that shit is not getting good if you fucking start doing that shit. Okay, Lauren, I am not saying that you did anything that you didn't do. You said this. These are your words. You, I asked you because you were saying how when I came how up... How well do you know Emma? What? How well do you know Emma? How well do I know her? What does that mean? Oh, how many times have you talked to Emma? What? Three? Two? How many times have you talked to Emma without me on the phone? One? And that was because we were about to call you? And before you, how long before you called me, did you talk? Be, you better fucking be honest with me. I'm, I'm... Are you drunk? No. I'm I'm so fucking irritated. It's unbelievable. I'm fucking all through enough help. And then after all this time of you and me being together, and fucking. Are you crying? Yeah. Why? What's going uh, on? Lauren, what, what's going on? Fucking mad. I'm mad as fucking hell, but you're putting your fucking friends before your boyfriend. When I'm not even trying to take your fucking friends away from you. Lauren. I'm so fucking pissed off about that. I'm not I'm fucking even trying to fucking accept the doctor. So you tell me the doctor's gonna be a fucking house all, all the basically all the fucking time. Lauren, the doctor is not and you, and you was gonna explain the doctor to me the other night and you stopped. Lauren, first of all the doctor is not over my house all the time. Then why did you tell me you was uh, the other night? What did I say? You said between the sister's house and, and, and my house. I... He, he's over here all the time between his sister's house and my house, but mostly it's my house. I said that he is in this building all the time. He no, said, no, 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 you did not. Lauren... You said between his sister's house and my house, he's here all the time. And and what and is this? It's my house. That's what you said. And again, what is this? This is an apartment. <laughs> so 
if you and about him hitting on you, you never fucking answer me. And I said, that means that he's hitting on you. And you said you would explain. What? You said, I asked you if he was hitting on you, and you said, being, you said you would explain to me that he was about him hitting on you. Why are you so obsessed with this guy? Because you're making me obsessed with him. Mm-mm, you can't blame me for your behavior. Okay. You always and I when we first met. Over your house. What? Well, you, we went from two hours a night in aqua aerobics when we first met. So meeting your brother and he, well, you have your friends with, uh, with you going to the gym. They met him and invited him to a party over your house since then. Since then, he's been over your fucking house all the fucking time as far as I'm concerned. Not to mention you want to have a fucking coffee with him on, on a coffee date. Come on. And, and you know what? And when I get upstairs, they're going to be at my house because they're all over there. So, I mean, all, including the doctor, right? Everyone is here, yes. They're all off tomorrow and they're here. Okay, then I want you to, exp- I want you to tell me what you were going to explain to me the other night. About the fucking doctor being over your house all the time. Because you said he's he's never at his house anyway. He's always at the at this complex, either at his sisters or ever my house hanging on me and my brother, and usually he's over my over my house with, with me and my brother. That's what you told me the other night. So explain to me about the doctor and about him hitting on you, because that was something you were ex- Gonna be explaining to me. When I don't. To have, when he was supposed to have strict rules of not hitting on you. First of all. No, don't first of all me. Just explain it to me. What am I explaining? He's a friend well, of my yeah, brother. Well, he's, yeah, he's a friend of your brother. But what? Does he really need to be there all, all the fucking time? I'm not the biggest, the biggest thing I want you to explain to me is why the fuck is he hitting on you when he knows he's not supposed to be? Okay, That's I'm, what I want to know. Okay, I am not going to tell my brother who he can and cannot have over. I'm just not going to do that's, that. That's not what I'm saying. That's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is I want to know why he's hitting on you when he's not, when he knows he's not supposed to be. I don't know what he knows, but I, I mean... No, 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 no. What? You told me before that he knows he's not supposed to be hitting on you. Uh, what are you trying to say? I mean, I don't know what you're trying to say. I'm trying to say you told you told him that back off. Basically, you back off is what you said. You said it in different words, but you, you said it nicely. And you told him to back off. Lauren, you're being because, controlling. Because, because, yeah, because you told him that, I, uh, that him and the neighbor was over, that, that there was something there, some commercial or something that came on, and the neighbor said something sarcastic, and the doctor said, was supposed to be nice, or was it was supposed to be nice, or or was supposed to behave? Is what I said. Was supposed to behave is what the doctor told the neighbor. Lauren, you're being controlling right now. I am not being controlling. I'm asking you what the fuck is going on, Ramona. Lauren, you're being controlling. He's hitting on you again, and you're not stopping it either, are you? Lauren, you're being controlling because you're acting like I'm having people hit on me just because I have friends. You didn't answer me. Now, you didn't answer me the way you would have fucking answered me if it weren't true. He's hitting on you and you're not stopping it. 
And here I, I am taking here I am taking hell for what I fucking did. What are you taking hell for? For all the shit that I fucking did with these other faggots. What? All the shit you did with with fucking Emma and that fucking piece of shit from Canada. Now, when I to get off the fucking topic, you know, goddamn well, I'm staying right on the fucking topic of the doctor. That's because you're obsessed with him. Yeah, fucking right. How long, how long has he been hitting on you? Lauren, I'm not going to talk about the doctor. What? Why? Because it's a doctor? What? Because it's a doctor, and I don't mean shit compared to the doctor. I'm not going to talk about the doctor because you're obsessed with him and because you've... No shit. You told me you were. Uh, you were going to tell me what's going on with the doctor. Yeah, nothing's going on with the doctor. And outside of that, I'm not going to no. discuss him. Yeah, That's I'm not... Gonna, that is only going to hurt us. Well, then that's your choice. But no, I'm not... that's your choice. It's your fucking choice because you don't want to fucking tell me. You keep this shit from me. What are you keeping from me? I am not keeping anything from you, Lauren. I just tell me. No, I don't have to tell you anything. You don't know. Then you keep you keep this shit from me, which means you're cheating on me. Okay. First of all, well, what are you doing with the doctor? Nothing. Well, you ain't telling me. Lauren, I don't have to. I don't have to report anything to you. Okay, you don't. Oh shit! To... I fucking report everything to you. You don't because you didn't tell me about Michelle Simpson. I had to find out on my I own. I fucking told you about it tonight. How can you say that? I said, one of my thoughts, you didn't tell me, he'd see the message earlier, which he first fucking called. I can't do anything about the message that you don't look at. You need to explain this doctor to me. I don't have to explain anything to you, You fucking need to explain it, Lord, I don't have to. I want to fucking know. Because otherwise you're keeping shit from me, which means you're lying to me. Lord, I don't have to explain anything to you. You're fucking lying to me, then. I'm not lying to you about anything. I just don't... You're not going to control me. Well, you're not going to fucking show me anymore either, then. I'm not trying to control you. You are? Who the fuck is this fucking bitch in me? Who's what? Somebody's fucking texting me. And, yeah, you do need to fucking tell me. Because you're holding the shit back from me, and that's just, that's just not fucking right. I'm not you're helping. Being, with what you're not fucking telling me, you're not being honest with me. I'm not holding anything back. I'm just not going to let you control me. Oh, uh, that's the fuck. What's the fuck? Yeah. Uh, you're going to want to know this shit, but I ain't going to fucking tell you. Okay, well, whatever. But I I haven't even fucking read it yet. But just seeing a, a fucking name on there, I ain't gonna fucking tell you. Okay. Now, do you fucking come on. Come you want to keep secrets? I'll keep secrets too. There ain't no fucking secrets. I'm not keeping secrets from you. You're keeping them from me. And okay. so you tell me your fucking bullshit. About the fucking doctor, you have never fucking held from me before. Okay. I don't know about the fucking doctor. What about him? I want, whatever you're not telling me, I want to know. Um. I want to know about him hitting on you. You can tell me about that. Lauren, I don't have to feed you. God damn it, Ramona. You're, you're fucking doing things that you have not done before. It's fucking making me really weary. Lauren, everything makes you weary. Yeah, well, I everything have good reason. Everything freaks you that, out. 
I, yeah, it Why? Because of it, what happened in your past? Because of what happened in your past? I have good reason to fucking be freaked out about shit. Is this about you your past? Like you said, you and I have not met in person yet. I have good reason. But you're the one that I trust in most out of anyone because you know every fucking thing about me. And I'm going to read these fucking emails that I got or text messages I got about Emmer and, and Fierno. Uh, that's all I fucking read was Emmer and Fierno. What happened? I don't know yet. I haven't even fucking read them yet. I'm, I'm waiting. I can't even get to them yet. So I fucking go into them. I ain't even fucking trust them. So I fucking get done talking to you. Or so I fucking hear what we're fucking talking about. What, and, uh, and I'm, I'm not going to either until, I, I, until you fucking come clean with me about what the fuck is going on with Doctor. Lord, what is there to come clean about? I have a friend. I want to fucking know how close this goddamn friend is. This motherfucker has pissed us off since day one. He hasn't pissed me off. Really? Has he held your hand? No, Lauren. Well, that took an awful long time to fucking answer. Oh, Lauren. So why are you so has jealous? He, has he held your hand? I said no, didn't I? Has he kissed you? No. Should I believe what you just told me? I don't know. Should, no, no. Well, that's not a good answer. Well, what answer do you want? I want an honest answer. Well, I give you an honest answer and you don't want it. I want an honest answer. And he held your hand. Okay, I said no. Like, what? This is the fourth time. This is the last time I'm going to answer it. The answer is not going to yeah. change. Has he kissed you? No. Tell me what's happened. Well, what? You know what, though? It's almost like I'm so... Stop it, Why are you making such a big deal out of it? Tell me what has happened. You know, Lauren, it's almost like I wonder... You may, you're making a fucking soap opera out of this shit. Jesus Christ. All I want is fucking you to tell me. It's almost as if, if I want... Nothing hap- if nothing's happened, I, that's all I want to know. If nothing's happened, I, that's what I want to know. But see, I'm you going don't... to believe you. Okay, thank you for that favor. Well, thanks for acting the way you're acting. I don't know how I'm acting, but okay. Well, you, you're you acting like, a, like I'm just fucking whatever. So you, why is he spending so much time over your house? Because he's a friend of mine and he hangs out with my brother. Okay, and how much does he hang out with you? I don't know. I don't count. Okay, let's, let's try that again. That again, considering... Well, you're very controlling. Well, and you're not. How am I controlling you? If I can tell me how many times I've messed up, I mean, I know how much I messed up, and I'm trying to fucking fix myself for you so that I can be better for you. Lori, you're not trying to fix anything. What? A, I just got a message. I'm trying to fucking fix myself so that I'm not fucking, that I'm not a fucking bad guy. Or so, well, I know I'm not a bad guy, but. 